Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the channel, y'all. I'm Melanie and Gemini, Missy Turo, back at you again. Welcome, welcome to all my new subscribers. Welcome back, welcome back to the returning. Y'all, I am going to be um, doing this reading off of the Panther Oracle. Um, depending on, I do and may confirm and confirm and confirm some stuff so whatever you in your mind about trust me it's all finna come out <laughs> um thank y'all for all of y'all likes y'all shares and y'all subscribes um if you would like to go towards members only to see what's being said after the video turns off you know go to my subscribes um i have videos many videos if you're just returning welcome back welcome back so let's see what's going on let's see what needs to be said let's get this deck going i want to think about these cards they be hard to open sometimes especially when your nails is what your nails is what your nails is so let me get everything going y'all this is the deck this is the deck this is the deck so y'all cleansing the deck feel the heat coming off this dag on Polly Santos. Okay, y'all. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what needs to be said. Um, don't forget if you um as far as like readings are concerned, all of that is in the description box below. And make sure you hit that all bell too. What else? What else? What else? This is like the second reading, but in a sense, like it's a second reading, but um, the cutoff readings are in the, you know, the members only. It's like $5.99 um, monthly. So if you wanted to know, trying to see. So let's see. Okay, I like the cool. I like how they feel in my hand. Okay, I'm getting something about an ending. Something about an ending. Something about loneliness. Maybe someone is lonely because of an in of an in of an ending, or maybe someone feels loneliness. Maybe someone's birthday is on the seventh, the ninth, the sixteenth, the sixth, the first, or maybe March, September, July, January. Or the first of a month, the third of a third of a month, seventy nine. Maybe someone was born in seventy nine. Ooh, someone feels confined, or someone feels confined. Maybe something about someone going to jail too. Maybe someone is isolated from the people that they did wrong and realizing these were the right people and getting something about stubbornness someone doesn't want to hear something about an ending or someone doesn't want to hear, like maybe someone doesn't want you doesn't want to hear your name or maybe someone doesn't want to hear your name due to the things that they've done to you mm -hmm. Maybe you've been seeing 777 a lot or 77. Maybe someone's birthday is July 7th. Maybe someone's birthday is on the 18th. Or maybe someone's born in 1979. The 31st. Or someone was born in either 1956 or the 5th or the 6th. Or you have been seeing 11. You're getting an intuition that somebody going to jail. Moving forward. What else, spirit, do I need to hear and see? Yeah, when I, I hear frequencies, like it's a white noise. It's like an e. Moving forward. I'm getting something about, maybe something about a ceremony. Maybe someone was doing, some someone's possessed, I'm getting. Somebody was doing some type of magic. Maybe someone's birthday was August the 1st or the 1st of a month. Maybe someone's feeling loneliness after they're starting to see all the things that they have done to cause and create on someone's demise. Maybe it could have been a situation where someone was looking at their higher good instead of your own. 
of the, you know, I feel like if you're going to help each other, that don't mean, you know what I'm saying, one person pours into the other cup, other person's cup. More or less, it should all be equal. It's something about withdrawal. Someone withdraw from someone. Maybe someone feels like they in spiritual jail. Maybe someone quit cigarettes or someone is going through withdrawals or someone's going through withdrawals of being with you. Someone feels like someone doesn't want to hear it. Someone doesn't want to hear something. Someone doesn't want to hear that something was ended or has ended. something about someone doesn't want to hear something about an ending you see these little things right here i don't know if you see it it looks like you know um you know heartbeats when you can see it on a monitor or something like that i'm getting something about that or somebody wanted there to be an ending for you too but I'm getting something else about how someone was trying to do some type of rituals on you to end you, but it didn't work like that. Honestly, um, somebody is feeling alone now or feeling confined to what they did try to do. Like I'm getting something about reverse, something about something being reversed, friendship. So maybe someone doesn't want to hear after y'all ending, someone doesn't want to hear about you having new friends. Someone doesn't want to hear about the good things that's happening for you. The only thing that they want to hear is you having a hard time, but it's not working like that. I'm getting something about another note. Someone is stubborn at your job. Maybe someone is refusing to see what type of... um role they took in an ending what else spirit and get something about merit making so i'm getting something about someone is feeling lonely because you decided that you was going to leave a situation or the middle of this reading is magic mysteries maybe people were doing ceremonies to create an create an ending for you to create loneliness confinement someone didn't want you to listen and talk to your spirit guys and get it um maybe when you withdraw and you separate from these people these people going through this stuff maybe this could have been the friends or maybe it's some type of friends that don't that can't believe you ended something with them or maybe this was some type of friendship maybe someone's birthday is on the 9th the 7th the 2nd the 6th or the 4th <sighs> savings so maybe someone is trying to save maybe someone's trying to kick a habit so that they can save or maybe someone being in confinement is allowing them and helping them to save spirit thank you god spirit team of the highest white light confirmate endings okay there is an ending to their not being help but i'm getting something about aid there's going to be an ending The endings that you went through, you're being helped. I'm getting a helping hand. So I'm getting pretty much maybe someone that was born in 1979. Maybe someone that was born on the 17th. Maybe someone's coming in to help you. Maybe someone's upset right now due to a situation. Maybe feeling lonely. Maybe someone was praying for someone to come through. Accident. So y'all, someone... I'm getting something about someone did something by accident. Maybe someone needed aid or something about an accident. Maybe someone needs to caution their self or there's a reason why you are lonely so that you can deal with you and no one else. These people, I'm getting something about someone going to jail or being confined due to some type of accident. I'm getting to that. Maybe someone um, hit a a person 
riding on a bicycle, y'all. There was some type of injury. Maybe somebody is, in, is confined because they got hit by a car. Or I'm getting something about maybe somebody was confined due to hitting somebody and maybe something about drunk driving. Didn't see somebody. What else, spirit? What is this confinement? What is this confinement? Someone is in confinement due to a gift. So maybe someone took a gift that they was not supposed to take. Maybe someone's birthday is on the 3rd, the 6th, the 9th. Or someone's 36, 56. Or maybe someone hit a child who was 16, 17. Maybe someone who's 17 is needing help and aid. Maybe someone, I'm getting something about someone needs help. Maybe someone needs legal aid due to a situation that they are going through with someone. Maybe someone needs some type of um, advice or legal advice. Maybe someone's scared too, y'all. Maybe someone's stubborn and refused to see the truth. Someone is stubborn and refused to see that you are being helped and you will be helped. Confirmation, y'all. What about this ceremony? Mystery and magic. Real estate. So, y'all, something about something doing with accidental real estate. Or maybe someone's in fear of maybe where they're going to live or where they're going to be. Maybe someone's in fear after they did something to you. That's crazy. I'm getting that someone is having withdrawals from people, places, and things that serve no purpose. Maybe someone's withdrawn from things that's costing them too much money. I'm getting to collaboration. So maybe it's a gift coming in and someone's helping you get this. Maybe someone's showing you something or helping you get a place. Or there's a gift coming to you in the form um, of like a place, real estate, a job, working with people that you, you can see yourself working with. I'm getting luck. So y'all, something's finna happen, y'all. I'm getting that. Maybe someone's frightened about something that's going to happen or not fun or not going to happen, but it is, I'm getting. Maybe someone's 32. Maybe this is happening in 62 business days, 2 to 6 business days, 7 business days, 4 to 5 business days. Maybe something that you're going to get, something you're trying to win. I'm getting something about 10000 to $10 million, y'all. Making it all make sense. Someone is finna win something, get something. Someone needed help. Due to a situation that somebody put them or you in Gemini, someone tried to victimize you. And I'm getting right here that someone backed you into a corner and made you feel like you ain't had no one to depend on but God. God is sending the right friends and the right people of the highest white light. Not these shady ass individuals that do things just to get likes, clicks, and beneficial monies and stuff. And to heal what happens to you type of energy. Mm -mm -mm. Moving forward, fate, y'all, this is faded. What you're finna get this real estate, um, it says merit, making so some type of merit or, you know, elevating I'm getting. And honestly, something about something being accidental or maybe something accidentally happening and then some real estate being yours. Or maybe you, like, it's like once in a lifetime, like, look. Fate. This was fated for you to happen because of things that somebody did to you. But see, God is going to help you. I'm getting aid with a hand. So y'all making it all make sense. Whatever y'all stressing about, don't worry about it. I'm getting indulgence. So maybe someone is trying to bribe you or bribe somebody or bribe someone. Maybe someone's trying to bribe someone for their savings. Or someone's trying to... um proposition somebody something or maybe somebody has been indulging too much 
and maybe someone is having withdrawals due to certain um, substances, addictions, making it all make sense. Maybe someone is cutting the way they spend money as well that I'm getting. I'm getting, maybe you've been saving more money than you've been spending or trying to save the money or save money that you feel is unnecessary. Go. I'm saying, I thought it said go, goal, G O A L. So maybe someone is going to help you with your goals due to some type of weird accident that had nothing to do with you, but it had to do with other people's egos and people wanting to stop you and trip you up on your journey because they weren't going good on earth. Mm -hmm. Real uh, readiness. So maybe someone is ready after something happened, or maybe someone got hurt. Or maybe somebody was sick and couldn't fulfill their whole duty as where they were working at. Or maybe something happened to where something stopped you from working due to an injury. What else, spirit? I'm getting introvert. Maybe someone, um, maybe you're an introvert and maybe um, you're in a situation where you don't like being around people but you're ready. You're ready to conquer the world and whatever it has for you. Maybe life was cold and you just kept running into people with these weird energies. So you just decided to be alone. It made you very frightful. The people that, you know, the energies of what they can carry, what they can do. Maybe somebody is too is overloaded by so many things they have to do. All this paperwork. Maybe someone's trying to figure things out. Maybe you're a real estate agent. Maybe someone is being bullied by somebody in the real estate industry. Or maybe someone is waiting for something to get done. Or maybe some, you're ready for something, but something is not, you know, just there yet. Maybe you're trying to move, but maybe they're doing something about ele electrical or electricity. 